Hello, friends. It is Abs from the Oils Market, and I wanted to pop in and share with you guys um, a little bit about the starter kit, but I wanted to break it down by specific. So today I wanted to talk about using the starter kit for your skin, like beauty tips with your starter kit oils, okay? And I thought it'd be fun to start breaking the starter kit down by topics. So today is on beauty. Um, so when you get your starter kit, I'm going to show you this. You get it in a box. If you have not gotten your starter kit, this is what it looks like. It's a beautiful box. It was designed by the same people that did Apple. Um, and so you get your oils right here. So you're going to use these oils and then you're going to open this box down here. And then there's more things inside on the bottom. Um, so when it comes to skin, beauty, all of those things, I used to have really bad skin. Like my, I would always break out, not when I was a teenager when it normally would happen, but as I got older and became a mama and probably hormones and all the stuff, my skin was always breaking out. And so I was always using like over the counter, the benzoyl peroxide stuff. Um, anytime I would spend money on a fancy product, I would break out really bad. So I always was using the cheap stuff from like Walmart, Target, um, just to keep breakouts down. But it was horrible for my skin. And honestly, I was the slowest on trying Young Living for my skin. Um, everything else I was switching out, but for my skin, I was really, really nervous because everything else, all the high-end products always mess, messed with my skin. So finally, I started using oils on my skin and it actually made it better than anything else that I used, including benzoyl peroxide. <laughs> Took me a long time to break that habit, but I have since broken it and it has benefited my skin so much. Um, so I'm gonna show you some of my top things and they're all in the starter kit, which is awesome. Um, so when you get your oils, you're gonna have all of these oils on top and then there's a couple more at the bottom. So for your skin specifically, um, frankincense. I mean, that's like the baby Jesus oil. It is the end all be all. If you, know, if you don't know which oil to use on your skin, frankincense is always a must. This is also gonna benefit your um, not your hormones, your emotions. Um, it's very grounding. It's very supportive. It's great for your immune system as well. There's so many benefits to frankincense. I would really, really encourage you guys to Google what are the benefits of frankincense. Um, there's a lot that I actually cannot even say on camera because um, I can't make any claims since I am a distributor, but you can look it up yourself because this stuff is legit. So look up the benefits of frankincense, but this is incredible for your skin. It's going to give you like a beautiful glow. Um, it's really good for like fine lines, um, blemishes, smoothing your skin, so many different things. Frankincense is amazing. Um, I was using this on my belly too when I was pregnant. Um, it's just, it's good for like everything. So I highly suggest frankincense for all the things. Um, Another really good one for your skin is Valor. Valor has blue tansy, which if you look on like high-end sites of fancy stuff for your skin, um, blue tansy is in a lot of the really high-end stuff. And it is incredible for your skin. There's also other oils in here that are gonna be a benefit to your skin. Let me actually just read it to you. Um, and if you don't know what is in an oil bottle, it has the ingredients here. And if it doesn't show you here, then all you have to do is peel back this label, if it will let me. <laughs> and then your ingredients will be there as well. It'll tell you the directions and the um, oils that are in here. But this has um, black spruce, camphor wood, blue tansy, frankincense, and geranium. Those are all really, really good for your skin. So I use this for my skin as well. Um, lavender is like the Swiss Army knife of all the oils. Lavender is good for all things. Sleep, emotions, calming, skin, boo-boos, too, too much in the sun, um, so many different things. Lavender is incredible for so many different things, but for your skin specifically. And then, surprisingly, lemon is also really good. If you have blemishes, 
lemon is really good to put directly on your skin to help kind of dry it up. If you're like, it's summertime and you're gonna be in the sunshine, don't do it in the daytime if you're gonna be out in the sun. Um, Cause the, all the citrus oils can make your skin more sensitive to the sun. So do that before bed at night or if it's in the winter time and you're not gonna be in the sunshine very often, you can do it in the daytime. Um, but those are like the top oils for skin support. So different ways that you can use it, you can put them directly on your face, um, especially lavender and frankincense. They're very powerful, but very gentle on your skin. So you can literally just take a few drops, rub it together and massage it on your face. You can put a few drops in your moisturizer. You can also make like a glow serum. I have a glow highlight on my Instagram page that you can check out with different variations of oils and carrier oils. Um, I use for myself, I use rose hip, organic rose hip oil. I just get it off of Amazon. I'm not brand specific. You can just look up organic rose hip oil, but other people use jojoba oil. Um, what other oils? Argon oil. Some of those you can even just get at Trader Joe's. Um, but the rose hip oil does not make my skin break out. And so I'll put like frankincense, lavender, and Valor in a little like glass bottle. I don't have one of those bottles with me right now, but I'll just get a glass bottle on Amazon, like a dropper, like a two ounce or something. And I'll put like 10 ish drops of frankincense, Valor and lavender. <laughs> can't think um, of each oil in the bottle and then fill it with rosehip oil. And then I use that as my moisturizer. Um, you can just put it directly on your skin for blemishes. Sometimes I'll just take the bottle of lemon and I'll just open the lid and I'll do this. And so it just gets a little bit on my finger and then I'll like dab where the blemish is before I go to bed at night and it helps so much. Um, so anyways, those are some of the ways that I use the starter kit oils for beauty on my skin. Um, I always make these for my daughters too, for their skin as well. Another secret to beautiful skin and hair and just boosting your body is Ningxia. You get two packs of these in your starter kit. I would highly suggest ordering more um, after you get your starter kit. This is going to help your whole entire body, um, but you'll see the difference in your hair and your skin as well, in your mood, in your energy, um, just overall health and wellness. This is incredible. So those are my tips for using your starter kit for your face and for beauty. I will come back with other things because there's so many different ways that you can use all of these oils. Um, I use them all almost every single day. Um, they're incredible. So that is all. Thanks for hanging and I will chat with you guys later, Gators.